Hello everybody, what is up? Um, welcome back to Grand Theft Auto 5 um, Story Mode playthrough. Here we have part number 9. This is going to be an, a really interesting part. So uh, right here we have a meeting with the FIB. We, I guess we have kind of a mission, but not really a big mission. Sorry if you hear um, a noise in the background. One of my neighbor's dogs uh, um, kind of... Uh, uh, ran loose of the neighborhood and but they're not home right now so we're looking after him <laughs> so but here we go andreas sanchez dave norton and steve now oh he just appeared <laughs> your little immigration problem whatever the fuck it was we're straight oh absolutely yeah yeah you killed people you tortured because you asked us a, to you asked us to <laughs> dick dave, you can't do anything about this fucking turd yeah dave what can you do about me here's trevor Get your raid, looky looky, huh? <laughs> I thought Trevor was the reason. Shitbags and their favorite stoolie. What's he been telling you? No, oh, he just said how you guys were happy to help the government in any way you can. No, they're not. Really? Huh? Because I was told that if we helped out with that thing, which we did, our past indiscretions would be forgotten in a haze of patriotic fervor. Who told you that? Did I tell you that? I'm in charge here, Fruity. Me! Dave said that. Well, not quite. Well, can you explain that again? What I was saying. That reminds me of some Family Guy shit. Like, how do they switch spots? <laughs> what I mean by Family Guy is there's like a jury episode where, yeah, twelve and a half angry men. Some of the government. Seamus, I think. <laughs> That's exactly what they don't want to hear. That made me think of plane crap. Like, when I saw that in the... Corrupt in a good way. When I saw that in the trailers, I thought, you know, a plane crashed and that's what they were reacting to. But then I see in the game, they're only reacting to that statement? I mean, that's kind of underwhelming. As a way of bribing corrupt officials. Really? And where are they getting that from? Drugs. Those bastards love to sell drugs. Who doesn't? We think they're going to use this money to finance a war on our streets. And we need you boys to requisition that money for us. Yeah, <laughs> greedy bastards. Yeah, fuck you, Dave. We don't have time to prepare the right way. <laughs> it's not my concern. Sh it should be. Allocate any more resources to this. Yeah. It'll be fun. Fuck you, Dave. Yeah, fuck both of them. Nice I mean, Dave's okay, but whatever. Slick, that's what I call myself on Twitch. Clowns are done with us. You know, fuck you. Hey, hey, fuck look, you, man. fuck you, fuck you. How the fuck we gonna get this done? I don't know. I got it. Classic blitz play. It's an industrial area, right? So I'm thinking vehicles. Trash truck to block, tow truck to sack. We get some disguises, and we're going. We just gotta hope like hell these are the kind of agency men that don't carry a panic button with them. If they are, we deal with them. If and when. If and motherfucking when. I will keep my eyes peeled, General. Thank you, Michael. Hey, no problem. No, really. <laughs> All right, so that's just the cutscene for the mission, but it's not really a um, a mission as of now. Because we have some setup to do. It's a it's a heist, but it's not really a heist. There's no like pre what? Okay, there's no like preparation for it because uh, like you know how uh, like approaches. This is just you know one thing. All right, and guys, a few more details. We'll need boiler suits and masks for this job. The garbage truck. Let's get one from your park. Bring it back to the lot. And there's an auto repair place by the airport where we can get a tow truck. What else? Uh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Get away. That would be nice. Get something fast and discreet. We park it off the road a good distance from the lot. And make sure it ain't near something we'll crash into driving off. That's it. All right, man, I got you, dog. What? Huh? I missed that. Maybe shout a little louder? Bite me. All right, um, let's use... Uh, let's... Let's see if we can use this Tesla looking vehicle as a getaway. No, this ain't owned by Trevor. This. What about this? What about this car? What about this car? Unsuitable, how? 
What about this one? That's the same thing. How is this unsuitable? Watch, I'm gonna get in this and it's gonna say it is suitable, even though it's a piece of crap. I'd just rather get this over with now. Oh, come on. Hide it in a discreet location. Can I just... Can I hide it here? How about here? Can I? Is this good? Uh, it's not really on a road. Come on now. Sorry if you hear wanting in the background. The dog's just uh, in an unknown area setting, so... I, I... I was never really that good at this part. Um... Innocence bullet. Can I do this, or is this too, like... What is this? Um... Okay. I'll just... How about here? How about... Oh, how about in there? Maybe. That's nice and... Okay. Alright, cool. We have a getaway vehicle ready and waiting. Good work, T. Where'd you put it? La Mesa. Yeah, there's... Uh, Alright, come on. So that's our getaway vehicle. We're going to have uh, two more of those, I think, in the big one of the uh, uh, one future hi uh, two of the future heists in the game, depending on what approach we do. Um, so, anyways, as I was saying about the Family Guy thing, uh, it's like uh, they're showing the the twelve jurors, and Peter's on the left side as the camera scrolls down all the jurors, and then Peter's, you know, the last one, and he's like, "I switched seats." That's what that reminds me of. All right, let's switch to Franklin. We're going to focus kind of... Fo I just wanted to get the, that uh, uh, Blitz Play startup ready. But we're going to switch to Frankie here. Is he at the beach gym again? Oh, not quite. Wait, I think we are near uh, where we can buy s masks, right? Oh, yeah, I think we... I think we... Oh, shit. First person, there we go. Yeah, we're nearby. Let's do it. Wait, where? Is it north of me? It's north of me. Okay. Alright. Yeah, let's do that really quick. Use this uh, nice-ass car to get there. Man, I'm on the bit. This is what. Oh my god. Come on. I didn't mean to. I seriously did not mean to. Let me just lose the cops really quick. Oh no, we're on the beach. Come on. Just lose it. I don't know if I can do this uh, thing without. Uh, Come on, just lose the freaking star. Am I good? I think I'm good. Why Why does it take this long just to lose one star? Like, come on. I know this game's trying to be realistic, but still, it's annoying. Sweet Jesus. Wait, what? What's that? What are you eating? Is that the milk bone? Hold on, sorry, I'm trying to watch this dog here. What is that? Is that the milk bone I gave you? Looks like it. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, the dog didn't eat the treat that I gave him, but uh, now he did. Alright, so... So you can do these as any characters, and they, ha they each have their own dialogue when you do, which is kind of cool, you know? And uh, what's even cooler is because it's such a big map you can put the get getaway vehicle anywhere and they, it, it's, it's like they all have you know unique dialogue they all have their own dialogue of like 
Uh, each of the three protagonists, lots of locations. It's just, it's cool. Now this is a. Uh, now this mission is also a uh, green monster. We'll do that for Franklin. Um, Michael, what do you want, Mikey? <laughs> Wait a minute, Mikey. What do you want? He'll be a pig. Actually, no. I'm gonna give Michael this. Trevor will be the pig. There we go. And this uh, this mission is used in. Like the artwork it is a an artwork is you know what I'm talking about. There's a artwork screenshot that's you know a picture of this mission where you know the guys try these suits on, but it's only a, a specific suit. I handled the mask, man. Don't worry about him. Okay, so yeah, I'm now going to get try to get out of here. I know the Lester mission is right there. And that's the uh, series of, of uh, certain side missions, but the first one is required. Okay, not too far. Ah, Franklin using his uh, repo skills. Didn't even need to break the door, although it's got an alarm. All right, let's let's go over there. Sorry, bro. I love I love cars in GTA 5. They're all so fast. I see a random thing you can do over there. I'm not doing that just yet. I need to get this mission. Yeah, sorry about that. We're going over to Franklin's house because we got another mission with Stretch, or not with Stretch, but involving Stretch. Okay, let's go over to it. And I was going to say, when I did this, did somebody say yoga mission uh, two episodes ago? Um, I kind of missed something because, like, I didn't mean to uh, um, uh, get in the kitchen so early for the cutscene to trigger. It's uh, that's actually unique. If you, go into, um, if you go into Michael's bedroom, he'll say, Amanda. If he goes into Tracy's room, he'll say, Tracy. And then if he goes into Jimmy's room, he'll say, Jimmy. Yeah, so it's just kind of unique if, you know, looking for any uh, in their rooms for any one of them. Man, I'm trying to... Where am I? I'm trying to <laughs> trying to get to Franklin's house. Here we go. Alright, and this is one of the funniest cutscenes ever. They both have points. Ain't nothing positive about your crazy ass. Man, where's Tanisha at? She got more sense than to hang out with your sorry ass. You know you always been like this boy. What, I smart? Say, yeah, you say right. I say become a doctor. You say become a patient. I say, who is that? Hello, man. Here's Trevor, out of nowhere. Wow. Franklin, you never told me that you had a sister. I'm Denise, Franklin's housemate. And aunt. My mother's old dried up ass. Shut sister. the fuck up! Yeah, shut the fuck up! <laughs> Here, darn. Why don't you go get yourself? <laughs> shut the fuck up. <laughs> you know, I, I like that. Those dollar bills look. Is he looking at the ass? <laughs> Said something nice, not expensive. You want to be a greedy fucking cow, huh? No. Now get the fuck out of here. <laughs> this is her house. The boys. Sorry about that. What the fuck you doing here? He said. Friends, all right. Now let's party. Look, I had plans on getting some rest until this clown and my aunt came and fucked that up. My nigga, I just came over here to holler at you about the little thing. Man, I said I'm tired, dog. What fucking thing? I love things. I'm the king of things. I ain't talking to you, homie. Hey, let's go do something. <laughs> you do not tell Trevor that, Lamar. Okay. 
stretch thing, man. Fucking beautiful. Perfect. It's a gangbang. Let's go. Come on. This is how we get things done. Just bring Trevor along. He wants to just jump right in. <laughs> Who is this fool, man? Where this end from, man? This is the same van from the chop from the mission chop. Where's this thing happening? Down Grove Street. Grove Street. So Grove Street exists in this game, but it's not as lively in this game as it was in San Andreas. It's not the same with that bridge over it. In this game, it doesn't have a bridge over it. We shooting shit up, spraying some motherfuckers. I can drive by with the best of them. Behave yourself, man. Lamar, what's happening? What you and stress set up? We buying weight, homie. Some that'll move us up the food chain, nigga, for real. Mm -hmm. for real in this town, nigga. Particularly where you and stress concerned. Man, this is an investment opportunity. You got to speculate to accumulate. Ooh, first rule of business. Hey, since we're out here banging, either you got some dust. Fool wanna get butt naked? <laughs> That's a reference to San Andreas. We got Sweet on the left. I'm not sure who that is on the right. I think that's CJ up there. That might be. <laughs> that's a San Andreas Easter egg for you there. Uh, from the first mission. So I, I like how uh, in the in that cutscene there we have, uh, um, you know we have you know Denise's black woman attitude. Right? You'd be like shut shut the fuck. Shut the fuck up! And then we have Trevor's rage attitude. Yeah, shut the fuck up! <laughs> uh, I, I, I was thinking about what else to say, but I forgot. Also, where the heck? Wait, no. Nah. Wait, can I sh switch? All right, and Trevor just immediately nice to the dog. Of course, because it's an animal, but you know. And Trevor, and Trevor's coming along. Okay. Okay. Courier service. Package to collect. You got the grip. President accounted for. I thought Lamar was a poor gangbanger. What's he doing with that? Cause later. Sample. <laughs> now we talking. And that busted a up ass house. You see the walls kind of broken in. <laughs> My throat getting numb already. So we good, nigga, right? Well, let's go. How about a taste? No, man, we leave. I want a taste of the other side of the bread. Frank, Franklin doesn't want to do this shit. Me? Hey. He's tired. Give me the... Give me the... <laughs> what the fuck? Did we ask for a key? Or a what is that in his hand? Is motherfucking drywall? Hey, we got some motherfucking buyer's remorse out here. You can't fucking hustle a hustler! <laughs> yeah! So, so thank God for Trevor. Even though this is a, a weird place for Trevor, since, uh... You know, he doesn't really belong in this, you know, Black Hood community. It's good that he's here, since as a, you know, as a guy that runs his own drug business, he's had plenty of experience being ripped off by drug dealers. So, he had the suspicions that Lamar and Franklin would not have had. And... This, uh, this causes, uh, at first Lamar doesn't know who the hell, uh, you know, um, Lamar doesn't know who the hell Trevor is, but he starts to respect Trevor more for this reason. So we can switch between any of them here and have a, uh, shootout here. With the ball is on Grove Street. I thought Grove Street was family's turf, you know, whatever families are in this game, not ball is turf. Where the ball has come from, just out of nowhere. And why, why are they trying to kill us? They're the ones that try to scam, the, scam us. And anything, we should be angry at their asses. Why, what are they, why are they trying to kill us, man? That's something I never got. But it makes for a pretty great and fun mission. It's one of my favorite missions in the game. I, I love this mission. Uh, no, no, no. What? I'm trying to get the gun. Okay, there we go. Yeah, we'll try. Oh, <laughs> I just shot there, but it wouldn't let me because Franklin got in the way. Th thank God about th that about that game. And you can't even use weapons inside their own safe houses. You can't shoot your dog. You can't shoot, you know, the people that are close to you. You know, like Ron, Michael's family, and and Chop. I would never want to harm Chop in any way, shape, or form. Anyway, I know it's just a game, but still, I I can't even do that even in a, in a game. Is that Frankie? 
Yeah, it's Frankie. What a fun mission this is, seriously. And, you know, I, I say that Michael is the real protagonist of the game because, like, mo most of the storyline revolves around him. Like, you cannot, you cannot, I, and I mean you cannot mention the plot of GTA V without mentioning Michael. And, I, of course, I, of course I mean that for Franklin and Trevor, Trevor too, but, but Franklin feels irrelevant. I feel like I could say his name. I feel like I can mention the whole plot of GTA 5 without worrying, without mentioning Franklin once, except for the final mission, but that's it. I feel, um, everything else revolves around, you know, Michael and Trevor's friendship, but like for once we actually have a great, fun, important mission that doesn't involve Michael. You know, I like it, you know, it's a kind of a break from Michael, even though I, I do like him, but, you know. This is really great. The fight's over. Now you're over, punk. All right, let's go. So this mission can end in two ways. MC Clip. Is that the guy they were doing? Well, took the drugs from. This mission can end in two ways. I'm not really sure what way it can end. All right, this is Trevor's. I'm just gonna be Trevor here. Yeah. Oh wait, there's no radio on here. Do I have to pop them? I'm not sure. Follow Lamar. Okay, and I think we gotta lose the cops too. Oh, nice! Who the, who the hell? For what? These these fools scammed us. Uh, Stretch is st or Lamar is still um, defending Stretch here. Yeah. Race. This is, this is a great mission. Who knew that, that a gang mission would end on the jet ski? Alright, so now I'm, uh... So now I'm, uh, stuck with Trevor. I don't think we can switch because, yeah. Are they shooting at me? Jesus, mother effer. I think they're trying to shoot at me, but they're not. I just gotta lose these freaking choppers and boats. Yeah, they come at you with boats in this game too. Look at the beautiful water though. What? Are they chasing me still? No. I, f I feel like I'm still getting shot at though. Pacific Ocean. Yeah, that's the district name. Literally Pacific Ocean. I'm heading east? Oh, come on. Get out of here. Is Trevor by himself? Wait, what? Oh my god. Let's just go back. Damn it. Cause I don't wanna I don't wanna get away from LS. Although although I will be switching to Franklin. Actually I will get away from LS. Ah, go right, 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 right. Don't see me! Ugh. Should I just shoot them? I don't know. Come on. This is one of the two GTA games that has jet skis. The other being a GTA that gets like almost no love. Vice City Stories. Still my favorite of all time. With San Andreas as my second. Are we good? I really hope so. Actually, let's get on the shore, see if that'll help anything, man. Because, like, nobody's going to be looking over here. I don't think. Let's 
put that away. Just don't want to shoot by accident. Hood Safari. Okay. Now let me just look something up here. Okay, let me switch to Frank. What the hell? Where are you? Huh? What are you talking about? What's happening, homie? Man, have you spoke to Stretch? I want to know what happened with that thing. Yeah, homie. Stretch was as shocked as us. Really? But he didn't have half of Davis run up on him. Nah, homie, I don't think he was as shocked as us. Stop bugging, homie. You need to take a page out the crazy white man's book. That dude, cold. Look, man, keep an eye on stress, dog. I'm serious. Alright, so there you go. There's a few Lamar calls that I have missed, and I'm sorry about that, guys. There's, I know there's one that are long stretch, and there's another one, like, when uh, Tanisha breaks up with Franklin. And another one where, uh... After the jewel store heist or fame or shame? I ain't really sure, but uh, let's call Stretch. I need to speak to you fast. Oh, is that right? Shit, I need to speak to your ass too. What you taking some crazy white dude around the hood for, huh? Huh? Because that crazy white dude's the only reason why we ain't buy a brick of plaster, motherfucker. He the reason why we still breathe. It looked bad, little homie. Man, I don't give a fuck how it look, big homie. Matter of fact, let me ask your ass something. Why you set us up with a motherfucker that try to run a lick on us and clap us any fucking way? That shit was real to you and your geek friend fucked it up. That's on you, punk. Well, they're both right. Chris Franklin's obviously the more right one, but... Shit. Oh, I guess uh, while I'm here, I might as well. Shoot. Steal the tow truck. That depends where we're taking it. Oh, I can't get out. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna knock him out just cuz. Alright. I was gonna go to the next mission, but we got this, so let's go. Take the. To Where is it? Uh. Ugh, are you kidding me, man? Man, I don't wanna freaking do that, man. I'm just gonna call a cab. That's annoying, but whatever. I got a lot of setups to do for this. And of course I'm in the wrong freaking area. <laughs> oh. I can go through here, right? I, th I hope so. I don't even know where I am. <laughs> okay. Oh, we're by the Maze Bank Arena. Yep, that's what it is. Sorry about the boring ride. It's just, you know, this is the, I think this is the only heist in the game that doesn't have like a prepper, like a, like a, you know, like a board, basically. Like, I don't know why they call it a heist, though. Like, to me, heists are actually like robbing places, but there's two heists in the game that I don't know why they are even considered heists. First of them being, uh, I'm just gonna say it now, the bureau, the bureau raid, because we're not like stealing for fun. We're stealing to get this, uh, to get these stupid corrupt FIB agents off our case. And the second one, and second one is this one, yeah. You know, so of course it would make sense for Franklin to steal this tow truck, because uh, ah, oh my God. Oh, we don't gotta get that repaired. Doesn't I don't think so, but damn man.
Alright, here we are. Leave the tow truck. Is my... Do we need this? No, we don't. Okay. That, that looked green from the distance. I don't know why. Oh, this thing drives like shit. Oh, one second, guys. Hey, the tow truck's at the lot, dog. Ready to go. He's just gonna leave him tied there? What the hell? What is this? Oh, of course. Alright, I'm gonna show you guys it. The phone calls, all the missed ones anyway. I didn't... I turned the radio off, god dang it. Man, only inches! Okay, let me, uh, I got you guys. Hold on one second here. Okay, here's Lamar after the long stretch, or casing the jewel store. You calm down since that recycling job, dude? Yeah, I'm calm. Since I'm dealing with professionals instead of you, clown. Use a professional pain in the ass. Huh. At least stretch out now and I ain't gotta run with you suckers no more. Shit, good luck. You fool with me. Alright, there you go. And here's another one. No, wait, 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 wait. Sorry. So here's the uh, here's the call between Trevor and Lamar. Okay. Hey G, it ain't G, it's T. Trevor. Exactly. Yeah. Fine. What's up? Uh, you call me, nigga. You been smoking? No. Probably why I'm calling you rather than doing something more productive. Well, this is fun, but a little awkward. Exactly. <laughs> Even though uh, Trevor freaks Lamar out, Lamar does seem to like the dude, you know. Even though he might not show it all the time, but uh, this first, um, this is uh, so this is a series of Lester assassination missions, which aren't required to beat the storyline, except for the first one. This one is. What's up, man? Sit down and face forward. I don't get what's don't with Lester's attitude here. I, I guess he's money. trying to be conspicuous, but still. Life invader? Oh shit, y'all two did that? Look forward. We're two strangers having a friendly chat. And don't pretend that you liked Jane Norris. Oh, man, I, I like how they bring this up. I mean, yeah, the dude I source worked the child slaves. <laughs> the stolen sold everybody's private information. And even ripped his Lester own friend's ideas off and walked around like thinking the about that. doing it, but... Man, I don't think the nigga deserved to have his fucking head blowed off on TV. Oh, well, aren't you just a moral majority? You know, that's why the world is the way it is today. When a paid thug gets all namby-pamby when someone asks him to act like a paid thug and for a good cause. Man, check this out, homie. I like blowing motherfucking fool's heads off just as much as the next psychotic asshole. But I just don't look at the <laughs> okay, shit as doing a good deed. Well, now you can, because it's not fool's heads, it's asshole's heads. And not just Fool. heads, you know, trashing cars or planning lies, forging evidence, anything we can do to take the battle back to these turds. You know, <laughs> Lester we'll loves the, the word turd. We'll right a few wrongs while we're at it. <laughs> Shit, okay, cool. 
Right, so, you heard of Mollus? Hell yeah. Okay, so there's a new Mollus, sort of a super Mollus, and it's called Priapolds. It's giving the living rigor mortis. Only Brett Lowry, CEO of Bilkington Research, paid off the FDA. Now, he doesn't care that his hardness pills are giving desperate middle-aged men the world over heart attacks. Damn, man, that sucks. Yeah, it does. Now, Mr. Greedy Lowry is staying at the Von Krastenberg Hotel in Richmond, of course, he'll be well protected, but if he goes away, then America goes back to using Mollus, and Beta Pharmaceuticals gets a big bump in the price of their stock. Damn, man. All right. Fuck it. I got you. I thought that you would. Now, consider using a sniper rifle or sticky bombs. You know, whatever. Do it your way, however you want. I'm going to make the investment. We don't speak about this or anything. Now walk away, and I'll stay here till you're gone. I'm not sure what's his reasoning for acting really conspicuous, but whatever. Lester is a smart guy. He knows what he's doing, so not really going to question it. So, so yeah, we're going to do this. Wasn't this car here last time? I'm not sure, but... So yeah, we got some, I got something interesting to show you guys in this mission, you know, later. Um, okay. Can't believe this game is about to be uh, 10 years old. How did that happen? No, seriously, how did that happen? I'm not even joking. Uh, that's an actual question. Anyways, let's do this thing. Alright, so this mission was kind of a pain in the ass. For me, anyway. It's just, I, I never I never knew what to do, like, when I get here. Oh, shit. Like he said sniper rifles are sticky bombs, so I guess he's right, but I don't know. We'll see, though. Okay. Good vantage point. The thing that I didn't like about this mission is that I could never tell who um the freaking uh, target was but of course if you if you mess up do one thing wrong then you're fucked you failed and you gotta wait it, a minute doesn't seem very long but when you're literally doing nothing it feels like an eternity <laughs> and and yes i haven't played this game as much to actually know what the guy uh, who I'm supposed to assassinate looks like. Mm hmm. Just aiming at this fool's head. I don't know if sticky bombs are work will work. Obviously, if I get closer than this, then the mission fails. They're gonna su suspect going something. Obviously, I zoom out just to know where the guy is. Is he gonna get... I just... I don't know what the... Uh, I think he'll show us a dot on the map. Radar. Shit, where is he? Keep your eye out for anything unusual. Let's see if we can get through one day with. Is it this pink guy? Man, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha. Woo! Did it. And we gotta lose cops, right? Or we gotta lose these guys. We'll see. He's here somewhere. Hey, hey, can't find me. Boss is down. Getting it. Uh, I like the themes of these missions as well. 
It's, it's They're just random, you know, music notes, but they keep the mission interesting. That's what I like about this game. I hope it returns in GTA 6. Alright. Oh, shit. Yes. Alright. So let's... let's $9,000. Thank you, Lester. I think Lester's the one that pays us. I'm not sure if he's rich or whatever, but we're gonna head up this way. Hey, it's done. I know. Good work. Let's see. Let me know about the next thing. Will do, uh, but before that, I've got to tell you something. Our investment portfolio is getting a little, uh, successful, so I figured we needed some tangible assets and property, so we bought a house in the Vinewood Hills. Yeah, sure, man, whatever. You know best about this shit. And we needed someone to live there you know, for tax purposes, so some guys are moving your stuff in. Oh, shit! Meaning I don't have to live with my crazy-ass aunt no more? Man, I don't know what the fuck to say, dawg. Don't say anything, especially if a man in a suit comes to the door. Ah, I'm joking, that probably isn't gonna happen. It's yours, enjoy it. 3671 Wispy Mound Drive. Thank you, Lester. He's, like, the fact that Franklin got really excited about this and I, I like Lester for this Franklin immediately loves Lester because of this and he can't thank him enough I mean with that with living in that you know small room to now getting a house of his own that's what's up man seriously so I'm gonna I'm gonna let you guys check out this uh, new safe house that we got and uh, that means that uh, we we no longer have our aunt's crib as a, as a safe house because uh well, yeah, obviously, because um, we don't live there anymore, and our ants officially kicked us out. Um, crap, I needed to go down one. Oh, can I? Nope. Nope, instead I can get stuck stupidly. What's going on here? Let's race, homie. Oh, shit. What are you doing? All right, fine. What? What are you doing? Oh. <laughs> okay, what the hell? Oh, shit, where do you go? What are you doing? What are you doing? What? What? Um, okay. Is he gonna fall down again? <laughs> okay. Whatever, man. Here we go. And we got Chop here too, which is wonderful. So, uh, I have a, um... Um, I have another Franklin phone call that I missed. Uh, I guess after Daddy's little girl. So I'm gonna play it for you guys now. Hold on. One second, guys. Hold on. I, I didn't get the cutscene for you guys, but uh, I'll try. One second. That's the breakup. Oh, it's that dude. I was just hearing about you. People talk, huh? Don't listen. Tanisha ain't people, nigga. She's somebody. Man, that was just a misunderstanding, dog. That girl still think I'm into her. You are, though. <laughs> she won't leave me alone. Mr. Fine Motherfucker. I wonder how she got that idea. Hey, stay strong. I'm here for you if you need to talk. Man, fuck you. Ha <laughs> Lamar. We, so this is a really nice safe house. Like, I mean, I want a, I want a house like this in real life. Damn, I really do. So um, let's let Franklin sleep like he wanted to do, which is downstairs over here.
All right. Gonna, I'm gonna go to Michael because we did uh, two as uh, two heist setups as. Uh... Wait, what? Isn't there five of them? Hold on. Let me th let me think. Because we need boiler suits too, right? Yeah, there is two of them. Whatever, I'll do these last two as my geek. Please. Sucks he's gotta take this piece of crap car. But yeah, we're gonna finish the high setups and then call it a day. That way we're ready to go in the next episode. To the next episode. I think this might be the, uh, the suits, because we need to... Alright, yeah, these are the boiler suits. And... Oh, I remember this. Sh this is where we were, we're in the long stretch. Boiler suits. Um, oh, we can only get one? Alright, I'm gonna do that one for Franklin. This is gonna be Michael's. That's gonna be Franklin's. And that's Trevor's. Like a candy store for adults, isn't it? And uh, I, the game has us uh, spend money, but I mean, it's necessary because. Uh, we have a lot at this point, you know? Like, you they always make sure we have enough money. Thank you. Alright, now I think this trash truck is... Yeah, it's moving, so... I gotta try to get there as quick as I can. Look out! Alright, boiler suits are taken care of. I'm sorry. Um, Alright, now the garbage truck. That's the last thing we have to get. And you could do the, you could do any of these as any of the three characters. I just wanted to do one as Michael. This is yeah, this is the most heist setups out of any heist in the game. Like I think uh, one one approach for the jewel store has one, the other approach has two. Um, the Merryweather Heist one has one, the freighter that we just did in the last episode, the other one has uh, two that we just did. Um, uh, the, the beer, the beer raid, um, I think the Polito score has two? I don't remember. I think it's two or one. Uh, beer raid has two, depending on which one. The other approach has none. I think Big Score has three, depending on the first approach, and the second one is like, I don't remember, I don't remember. But anyways, you guys get the point. I don't know why I came all the way over here, I don't even need to be here, I need to be, thank God we're close to the destination of, uh, like, where we're about to steal this trash truck. This trash master, if you will. Steal the garbage truck. I, I just hope he don't know that I'm chasing him. I don't think I'm gonna I'll be able to. I don't think I'm gonna be able to make a quick getaway here. Okay, I get it. I got it. Good. What? Okay. Okay. Well, I I know where it is. I think. Uh, I got no choice. I gotta go this way. Damn it. Are we supposed to get cops in this mission? Why do I have two stars, man? Oh, mission. You know, high setup. All right, well, where's where's El Burro? All right, it's got to be over here. I just wish the cops would fuck Move off. In. This is where I'm supposed to be, but like, I don't want to travel any further. Suspect made 60 miles per hour, and ah. they, um, right on my ass, up. man. 
Fuck you too! Just like Michael says in the prologue. Fuck! Uh, no. God damn it. Fuck. Fuck you. Uh, I hope that'll slow him down. Move. Move. Oh my god, I can't. Oh, because this is cop in front. I didn't even know. I'm like, what? I thought this thing was fast. Why the hell? Oh, fuck off! Oh my god, get out of here! <laughs> god. Get away! Get the fuck Get away. Get away from me. Get away from me. Get away from me, man. I can't lose them in this thing. That's the problem. Okay. I'm gonna try, man. I don't I don't know if I was even supposed to get cops on me. I really don't. Get fucked, please. Oh my god. Oh my god! How do I fucking lose them? Alright. Do I just kill them? I feel like I should just, like, be killing them, because I don't know how else to lose them, man. Come on. Come on. Get, get in gray. 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 Please, gray. Please, gray. 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 Alright. <sighs> Which way are you coming, fool? Oh my god. Help! Oh, help! Help, help! Ah, help! Help! Oh, whoo! Okay, how far are we? Thank God we did that. All right. I, I wanted to keep recording because that must have been, you know, entertaining for you guys. Damn. Shit. I get in my way, mother effer? Alright. And we made it. So we have all of the, uh... I would like to leave the area. Mikey. Yes, leave the area. Dude, I'm left. Damn, how far do they want me to go? <laughs> Come on down. Oh my god, do I have to get a vehicle? Just mission pass there already. Come on. I don't want that piece of shit. Come on, come on, get out! Oh my god. Whatever, fuck off. Dude, I'm like millions of miles away from it. What's going on, man? Your car. There oh. we go. What? Shit. As soon as I steal a car, then that happens? Okay. We're gonna call them? Yes. You ready to do this? Yep, got everything we need. Okay, so move already. 
When you get the stuff, bring it to Devin Weston. You met him at our internal rendition site. He's a major player in the investment world, so treat him with respect. I'll show him as much respect as a friend of yours deserves. Michael obviously doesn't like Steve, so uh, I'm, uh, I'm wondering if that was sarcasm. Now, before I end this episode off, I want to see something real quick. I'll be right back. In you get, baby. Okay, I actually never done this before, so hold on. Take me to a nice secluded spot. I never invited a prostitute with my vehicle ever. This is my first time. Does it work the same as GTA 3? Okay, I don't know what the hell I'm supposed to do with you. Shit! Um, Won't it be better if we find a nice Go somewhere spot? more secluded. Wait, hold on. Oh, I'm ch Denise, there we go. Uh, what up? No, dog. Let's go somewhere a word more romantic. Goodbye, would have been nice. Take me to a nice secluded spot. Jesus, does he ever stop talking? Trash, you come from trash, that ain't his fault. Makes oh come on. Won't it be better Your if aunt. we find a nice private spot? Yeah, she's a bitch. Like Like, here's the thing, when she in, in the mission we did when she says she got more sense since than the hangout with your sorry ass. The thing is, Tanisha's trying to be What's a successful nice? person. And so is Franklin. Like, come on. I've never done this before, I swear to god, guys. I have this is my first time doing something like this. Oh my god, my oh, controller is shaking. Yeah, what yes. is god? Can I do first person? I don't know. There you go. Okay, is that enough? Okay. Okay. Like, like, it's, Denise just hates Franklin. It makes sense why she says, oh, mm -hmm. to Lamar Thanks one time. Oh, she wants me dead anyway. Way. No, no, no. Cancel, 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 cancel. Damn it. Fudge. I don't want to do this again. I was trying to cancel, man. I feel like I can talk to you. Come back and see me. Is she going to get out? You got to watch out, fool. No. Oh, what the hell? I'm just fucking around now. Um. But. Yeah, um. Yeah, uh, Franklin's aunt's a bitch. Like, no matter what he does, he's just... So I wanted to show you guys what happens when you try to... I'm back from the desert and I don't want you around here. But it's half my house. Lots of change, boy. Shit. And the funny thing is, you can do the hood safari mission and I think the long stretch as well. I'm not sure. I'm not, I don't think the long stretch, but hood safari, you can do that mission yeah, Franklin will still say why it's half my house, even though even though you are basically the the order in, in when you do certain missions in this game don't really make sense. Like for instance, you could do did some piece, you could do by the book first, where Michael says "fuck you," and then Trevor's like, "I'm beginning to think that's exactly what you want to do," and then Michael says, "Yeah, I just said the same fucking thing to my wife, even though you didn't do." Did somebody say yoga yet? Uh, that's the same. Same goes for this. It makes sense to do this before. Uh, hotel assassination because Franklin will still be living there therefore saying it's half my house but if he does a hotel assassination and moves out after he'll still say oh it's half my house even though he's moved out so it doesn't really make sense but something I just interesting just wanted to point out thank you guys so much for watching guys I hope you enjoyed next part we'll be uh, you know doing that uh, 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 government agency heist so I'll see you guys then bye bye